Hey guys, we're back with another video, and this time we're playing some Black Ops 3, and we're playing some Team Deathmatch this time. We're going to be using the FFAR, and yeah, I'm using Sparrow, and yeah, I was using Vision Pulse before, but found that it, uh, it didn't last that long, so I just switched to Sparrow. And usually I use the Reaper with the Scythe, the minigun thing, but yeah. <laughs> um, I've been playing a lot of games like Final Fantasy V again lately, uh, Pokemon Violet, i got to play more of that, um, and Fortnite Festival, Rocket Racing, the Lego, and Battle Royale and stuff. <laughs> and yeah, I've also been playing the zombies in this game recently because this is my favorite zombies uh, in this game, Black Ops 3. Some people prefer Black Ops 2 or 1, and they say that's like the best zombies, but I think Black Ops 3 has the best zombies because it has some of my favorite maps like the Rising Drac, uh, Revelations, Origins, and yeah, Shadows of Evil is really good too, and yeah, um, I just really like those maps, um, but Black Ops 2 has a lot of really good maps as well, like Buried, Origins is from Black Ops 2, and yeah. They remade like almost all the Black Ops 1 maps for this game, except 5, I think. Well, yeah, and Call of the Dead. But yeah. Uh, I was gonna like do some of the, the other Easter eggs that I didn't complete. Like the Shangri La one, or like Zetsubo no Shima, or Derizendrak. So I think that'll be pretty fun. And yeah, uh, Final Fantasy V, I think I'm like halfway through the game, it's pretty difficult, <laughs> you have to grind a lot, and you have to find like the right strategy to defeat each boss, <laughs> and all that, Ooh. so yeah, um, I still wanted to play Final Fantasy 9 and 10 after that, and yeah, <laughs> there's still Dead Space, I gotta be the Hogwarts game, <laughs> there's just a bunch of games that I'm like going back and forth on, kinda. Oh yeah, Annihilator is like a good specialist in this game too. And I prefer this multiplayer over Black Ops 4, because this is a little bit more closer to, like, uh, old school Call of Duty, except, like, the jetpacks and, um, wall running and stuff. But I kind of like the jetpacks and wall running, because, uh, it allows for, like, a bunch of different gameplay mechanics and styles and stuff. And it's also in zombies, like in Shadows of Evil. And yeah, I've made gameplays of this before in Zombies, but yeah, just explaining if any of you haven't seen or played this game before. And yeah, Shadows of Evil is kind of hard, because <laughs> you got to do all the rituals and stuff, and you could die if there's a lot of zombies, and then like the, the Apothecan guys. And yeah, the pack-a-punch room is a little bit tricky in that one too, because you could fall and perma-die. <laughs> so yeah, it's a pretty crazy map. I remember doing the Easter egg in that one, it was pretty fun. And you get the swords and stuff. And... Ooh, I, thought, <laughs> I thought it was a person. Um... 
Yeah, in Black Ops 1, I would use, like, the FAMAS a lot, so this is, like, almost the same gun, just, like, a futuristic version of it. And also, this map is, like, Nuketown from Black Ops 1, but, like, all futuristic, like, <laughs> more futuristic than, uh, than Black Ops 2, since it's, like, further in the future, I think. Might have said that already, I don't know. <laughs> Ooh, nice. <laughs> so, yeah, um... There's so many different things in Final Fantasy V you can do with, like, the job system. Like, there's so many different jobs, it's kind of crazy. But, yeah, it... It's pretty difficult <laughs> compared to like Final Fantasy VI. I prefer that game kind of over it, even though I didn't beat Final Fantasy V yet. But yeah, I don't know. That's just what I think. <laughs> um. Yeah, maybe I'll make gameplays of, like, Black Ops 4, because I still like that multiplayer, I just don't really play it that often. Um, oh, and maybe, like, the zombies in that game, in Black Ops 4, because it is, like, pretty different than this game. This game, Zombies, is, like, closer, closer to Black Ops 2 and 1. <laughs> and, um... There's gobble gums and stuff, but uh, it's a little bit different in Black Ops 4. You can get like specialists that you, uh, they like recharge over time after you use them. Like you can get like a death machine thing or like Thor's hammer thing. And then the gobble gums in that game, they're like called elixirs and they work almost the same. I think there's like a bunch of different different ones compared to this game but yeah and we got a win <laughs> so yeah that was some black ops 3 on the nuketown version 3 because <laughs> it's also in black ops 2 and yeah <laughs> Maybe we'll play some more of this, make some more gameplays, also Black Ops 4, maybe Black Ops Cold War. And yeah, I hope you guys liked the video, like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys later.